to boxing and Ricky Burns says he isn't running scared of Alex Arthur despite his no show at yesterday's press conference. Today the two super featherweights met head to head and despite being the underdog the man from Court Bridge insists he will upset the odds to beat Arthur in the champion's home city. Here's Ronald Leesk. Finally, face to face, Alex Arthur and Ricky Burns know that tomorrow's bout presents both men with a huge opportunity. For the champ and holder of the British, European and Commonwealth belts, the promise of a world title fight later this year, possibly at his beloved Easter Road. For Burns, the opportunity is to cause a huge upset and enter boxing's big time. What would a, a victory mean to you? Well, I, I, I don't know, I think I, I do speechless on the night, so I don't know what to say. Just need to take it as it comes. Well, victory means the world to me, and you know, and that's what I go out there to achieve, you know, and that's what I'm going to 21 wins from 22 fights. Alex Arthur's record and experience make him favourite, and his last fight against Boris Sinitsyn resulted in the Russian losing his European super featherweight crown. Great right hand from the Scots challenger, soon to be champion. Oh. Sinitsyn's gone! Oh, he's over! Burns is six years younger than his opponent and has a pro record of 13 wins from 13 fights. But despite his youth and the fact he's never gone 12 rounds, his coach insists he will create an upset. I've never been a sure in in all my life. I'm standing here now. You'll remember these words. We're lifting his scalp. <laughs> and you can see the whole fight live on ITV4 from 10 o'clock tomorrow night. Ronald Leesk, Scotland Today, Edinburgh. And uh, because both these fighters are from Scotland, I'm very much sitting in the fence on this one. So good luck to both Ricky Burns and Alex Arthur tomorrow night. Indeed. Thanks for that, Jen. Tonight's main headlines in Scotland. Thank you. Good evening. Alex McLeish believes the bookie and following Scott Murray's suspension weighed in at nine stone four pounds, the perfect weight to defend his British Commonwealth and European super featherweight title. The man they call amazing will face the Coatbridge fighter Ricky Burns at Meadowbank Stadium. And he's delighted he'll be making the first defence of his European title in front of a hometown crowd. Yeah, it's fantastic, but you have to use your experience and you know, handle it well, you know, so... I think I've done that now and I'm looking forward to the best on Saturday night. Oh, there's no pressure on me at all. Not everybody gets the chance to fight for British Commonwealth and European title after only, this is only my 14th fight. And I'm only 22 years old, so there's no rush for me.